allow me to alt tab out of here real quick and open up the map. Yay. Fuzzy finished his ethics exam. I don't care. You know, this isn't the right map. I deleted the one for... Da. Alright, so... Dungeon of Death. Where in the world is it? <laughs> um... This presents a problem, people, because I accidentally deleted it. Oh, dear. Dungeon of Death. I, I have no clue where it is. You know what, I'll pause it real quick and I'll look, I don't know, at a walkthrough or something to see where it is, because I kind of deleted the map file. So, I'll be right back in a sec. Alright, welcome back. At oh, jeez, sorry about that. Welcome back, everybody. We are recording, and it seems that the area that I need to look at would be in Area E3, which, by my understanding, would be Area E4, so we just need to head west and no, south. South, and the Dungeon of Death should north, I guess, then. Dungeon of Death. Where are you? Oh, is this it? I think this might be it. Shut up. Sorry, I'm trying to record here, though. Um, let's see. Dave Protection. And Dave Sorcery. Crossword Puzzle. This would be the Dungeon of Death. And let me pause it again real quick. Ah, sorry about that, people. Um, darn long pause that we had there. Um, I... Really hope the thing was paused all throughout that. Let me tap the mic, make sure it's recording. Okay, it is. Sorry, I'm just having to make sure that everything's working here. I am really kind of out of sorts here. Okay, let's wait. Yeah, I thought I pushed the wrong button again. Okay, we're still going good. Now, the, this kind of makes me nervous because this Dungeon of Death here, I I have not been here, ever. Like, the last time I played Might and Magic um, 5, I kind of skipped this up on accident. The World of Zine on 30 Gold a Day by Eerie the Cartographer. There is much to see in the World of Zine. To give a complete description of all the wonders to be sampled in the eight corners of the world is beyond the scope of this work. In these pages, I shall dispense a broad overview of the highlights that should be visited for a traveler to gain a working knowledge and appreciation of the magnificent land that is Zine. Huh. This work is arranged as a simple description of my travel. A traveler wishing to follow in my footsteps should expect to spend around 30 gold pieces per day on living expenses. The traveler, blah, blah, blah. Magic weapons and some sort of emergency teleportation device. Dark side and Castleview Town. What? Yeah. <sighs> Remember, they are just people, too. Um... <laughs> oh, whatever. Avoiding Castle Alamar. Population of lake size and Only turn children into goblins. Wow. First new crisis is really wow. Stay in the lakeside for a few months before leaving. Uh, Ryan Beast. Blah blah blah. Sorry, I'm just reading this to myself because I've, I've never really been here before. I 
not sure what to think. I'm not sure why these words are colored green or whatnot. Bravely charge towards the exit. <laughs> no sooner seen than stolen. Don't they get a reward or something? No, goodbye. <laughs> yeah, that's the thing. The monsters never even drop any gold pieces for you too in the arena, which sucks. But oh well. Uh, I'm 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 just reading over the storyline right now, and the green colored words—they probably don't mean much of anything, but. Or they mean absolutely everything to this weird puzzle that we're looking at here. Whatever the case, I'm just reading this over top to bottom to make sure that, you know, if nothing else, it's entertaining to read it. Dun, 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 dun. Octopus soup with arachnid garnish. Hmm. Explore Vertigo. This is weird. This guy goes through like all this crazy stuff and then he's like, oh, we go to Vertigo, which is the easiest place on the map. Oh well. Mirror. Shop. Where is that stuff whenever I try to shop there? This is the asshole that bought all of the gear out in front of us. You know, they had nice stuff like this, but no. A JVC moat maker? <sighs> wow, how long does this story last? A severe case of death. <laughs> Hmm. 
Now that has me curious right at the end. When the Sphinx has you baffled and Korak reminds a prisoner, Tito Therwolf smile and I'll be forgiven. Well, that makes no sense, but whatever. Let's explore this place. That was a long story to read. 39 across bones. What? Bones, remains, um... What the heck is this? Oh, I think I'm beginning to understand. We read through that, and we use the green words, and we try to use them as responses back to whatever these things 